Hello kids, today we are going to learn about some great black inventors. So please put your listening ears on and let's begin. Garrett Morgan. Garrett Augustus Morgan, one of the country's most successful African-American inventors, created the gas mask and the three position traffic signal. He was born March 4th, 1877 in Paris, Kentucky. So guess what? When you're riding down the street in the car with your parent or friend or family member and you see that stoplight, think about Garrett Morgan. Garrett Morgan. Alexander Miles. Alexander Miles was an American inventor and business person who was best known for inventing automatic elevator doors. He was born May 18, 1838 in Ohio. Wow, he invented elevator doors. So every time you go inside of a building and you get inside of an elevator and the door closes, think about Alexander Miles. Alexander Miles. Alfred Crowley. Alfred L. Crowley was an African-American businessman and inventor who was best known for inventing the ice cream mold and disher, later known as the ice cream scoop in 1897. Crowley was born on September 4, 1866 in Kenbridge, Virginia, just after the end of the American Civil War. Well, how about that? Every time you see the ice cream truck, and you go inside an ice cream shop, guess what? Or you're at home dishing out ice cream out of the ice cream box. Think about Alfred Crowley. He invented that little ice cream scoop that we use to make one, two, three, maybe four layers of ice cream. Now that's awesome. Alfred Crowley. Annie Turnbull Malone. She was a chemist and entrepreneur. Annie Turnbull Malone is known to be the first black millionaire by successfully developing and marketing hair products for black women in St. Louis. She used her wealth to help advance other African Americans and gave away most of her money to charity. She was born August 9, 1869 in Metropolis, Illinois. Wow, so now when you're, when you're doing your hair, think about Annie Turnbull Malone. She was the first black millionaire to successfully develop hair products for black women. All right, this is getting good. Sarah Good. Sarah Elizabeth Good was an entrepreneur and inventor. She was the first African-American woman to receive a United States patent and was known for inventing the folding cabinet bed. She was born in Toledo, Ohio in 1955. Wow, the folding cabinet bed. That's probably how we got the idea of the folding bed, right? We have a folding bed, it's not in a cabinet, but that's kind of clever. You can do your homework and then when you get sleepy, you can pull out your desk and sleep with your books. Wow, Sarah Good, very good invention. Henry Blair. Henry Blair was the second African-American inventor to receive a U.S. patent. He is known for inventing the seed planter, which allowed farmers to plant more corn using less labor and in a shorter time. He was born in Glen Ross, Maryland in 1807. Wow, this is amazing. He invented a seed planter. So when you, when you look at videos about farming and they're planting all these seeds at once, he was the one who invented that. And all they did was they built upon it and made other designs from his first invention. That's amazing. Good job, Henry Blair. Marie Van Britten Brown. She was an American inventor. She was the inventor of the home security system in 1966, along with her husband, Albert Brown. Did you hear how my voice got excited? Because I'm learning something. She invented the home security system. Wow, she was born October 30th, 1922 in Jamaica, New York, but not the island. I did the accent because I like visiting Jamaica, but it's Jamaica, New York. 
This is wonderful. Marie Van Britten Brown, she was the inventor to help keep us safe. So now when you have a home security system and you're putting it up, think about Marie Van Britten Brown and her husband, Albert Brown. They help to make us safe. That's awesome. This is from an activity that is created that you can download in the link below. And you can go ahead and do a little activity with the inventors we just learned about. Very fun. So until next time, I'm so glad that you joined in to learn about these inventors that we normally don't get to learn about in our books. So we normally learn about other inventors that are common and that are always commonly read and spoken about. But wasn't it wonderful to learn about a few new different inventors that we have not really heard about, right? Until next time, please like, share, visit us again for another wonderful video and another lesson because we love to learn and goodbye.